Welcome guys. Um, so today we're gonna hit a little bit of triceps. So I'm gonna use, show you how to do stuff on the bench, dumbbells, barbells, free weights, um, cables, whatever. Um, shouldn't take too long. Just watch the video, learn from me, and uh, yeah, enjoy. Okay guys, so the first exercise we're gonna do is a close grip bench. So check it out. So when we want to bench in general, this is what we need to do, okay? Um, we need to lay down on the bench, make sure we squeeze the shoulder blades together, Make sure it's equal distance apart from the bar each side. Make sure the bar's above your forehead. We're gonna push up, stabilize. Instead of doing a regular bench press or having your pinkies out here, we'll bring it in a little bit closer. A lot of people like to do this. I don't find that safe. I'd rather have right here, right outside your shoulder. So right here is where you want to have it. You want to explode with your triceps. So a conventional bench press, most people, you, you want to use everything, you know? Chest, shoulders, triceps, even back. With this, you want to use Straight up and focus on the triceps because it's explode off the triceps. Okay? So this is great to kind of build some the triceps, some actual strength. So right there, you're done. Come up here and wrap it. Okay? So I usually say about four sets of 12 would be great for this. Okay, so the next exercise we're gonna do is triangle push-ups. So for uh, for not for beginners, for moderate to expert, I'm gonna go right here, make sure chest is up, everything's straight, I'm down. Come like this. Okay, I'm gonna really work on the back of the triceps right there. On the back of the arm. Um, for beginners, go on your knees, but just make sure that our body goes down together all the way and we come up. Okay? So if one needs more triceps, just bring the hands closer together. If you're tracing more chest, obviously we spread the hands apart. Okay, so we're gonna move on to dips. Okay, so this is for beginners. Beginners, hands right here. Put your feet the farther you, you put your feet away, the harder it gets. The closer you bring it in, the easier it gets. So we want to bend our elbows to 90. Come up, up and down. If this is too easy for you. Move over here. Or for uh, intermediates, come right here. Or if you're here, we'll get even deeper. Chest up. Like I said, you want to make it harder? Go on the heels. There you go. Now for experts, people have to do actually pretty strong here. We've been doing this for a while. We'll just do it with the bar right here. We'll come up here, chest up, bring the elbows in, come in. Do it like that. Okay, so we have two exercises on the cable machine. So, the first one is a cable tricep push down. Just grab the bar, bring the elbows in, and come down and squeeze like this. A lot of people tend to do this. Move the elbows. Move the elbows, you can't isolate the tricep. So make sure we bring the elbows in. All the way down, all the way up. Control, all the way up, all the way down. Then we'll go over here. <laughs> Come underneath here, keep the elbows together. Come up. Boom. There we go. Okay, so check it out. I'm gonna sit down right here, put a good amount of weight. Make sure the elbows are locked in. Come all the way down, all the way up. Okay, Boom. Four sets, 12 to 15 would be great. Next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna try step extension. Dumbbells, so bring, bring it right here. Elbows in, all the way down, come all the way forward. Okay? When you're done, you can also do it with the bar. So we can grab a bar like this. Come up, bring the elbows in. Come up like this. Okay, so the next exercise we're gonna do is a tricep kickback. So we start out, make sure our back is neutral, bring the elbows in, and we're gonna extend. Right here. All right, so the last exercise we're gonna do is a skull pressure. So you can do it with dumbbells or with the bars. I find the bars are a little bit safer. It's like easier, I feel like. So tuck the shoulder blades in, Make sure the elbows do not move. Come all the way down, touch your forehead, come up. So the elbows don't move. A lot of people will do this, which you don't want to do. Elbows locked in. All right, so that wraps up everything we did for triceps. Obviously there's a lot more variations, a lot more stuff we can do, but for, if you're just beginning, those are what you need to do to be successful here. Um, triceps takes up two-thirds of your arm, looks like the horseshoe. Just make sure with any tricep exercise, 
that you have your elbows locked in and you're extending. So they can be anywhere, but they just need to be at a fixed location during the whole time. Okay, so that wraps up everything and uh, we're good to go. Just make sure you subscribe, like the video, and put the bell notifications on. Cool.